We were checking out BBC Cavisham Park. We were to come in through a bloody children's <laughs> and infant school, like up to two years old or something it says. And now we're, we're going to head off into the trees and look for a way to get into Cavisham Park. But this looks like the, the easiest way. Oh, right, sorry. Um, but just so you know, right, we've come through the children's park and somebody is def desperately wanting us to get into the BBC Cavisham Park. So I think we would be rude if we didn't attempt it. So let's go. So we've made it inside the BBC Mansion House premises and look, they've got their own bloody lake as well. They've got their own lake. And that's drawn a few comments from people who are with us here, yeah? Jordan and others are kind of surprised like look at what they've got. Look how much money they got. It's pretty so from the citizens of the United Kingdom confirming and paying for TV licenses that they don't need. Yeah. So uh, at some point we've got to sort of take a take a turn and go up sideways. And then we're gonna to cut to cut across and get in from the back the back side of the uh, the building so Wouldn't it be nice if we could just go and demand money we could just go we're selling you this radio but now you need a radio license 150 yeah. pound and then we could have big likes like this you know yeah happens. that's right <laughs> yeah <laughs> just like hold the whole uk to ransom i think they spend more money than the military the bbc Do they? yeah spend more money than the bloody military yeah, because it costs money, doesn't it, to make TV programmes and films and, you know, all that bollocks. And get beautiful gardens like this with yeah. mansion houses attached to them. Clearly the Queen agrees with brainwashing, you see. She knows it's a vital part of British life is being brainwashed. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, we're about to break through in a minute and see the actual house. I can see part of it there. So, don't know when the cameras are going to... We start seeing security cameras and shit. But Has it got security cameras? Don't know, probably. But there he is up there, look. Mansion house. So we're gonna have to keep sneaking through because we've got to get around the back of it somehow. It's abandoned, it looks like a tent from outside. It's very good, Nick. They haven't been out of here long. Let's see if you can see any security cameras or anything. That looks like a bunker, man. Oh, security camera, security camera. CCTV camera, so I'd come quick if I were you. Let's see if there's anywhere that's open. Nope. See if there's any cameras in this bit. Somebody smashed a window, look. Can't, can't see any up there. Okay. security camera up there on, on a pole as well. Static. Mm -hmm. 
So yeah, let's just keep going around then. This yeah. isn't just a, a, a frequency scanning station. No. Yeah. The lights are on. Is that a manual car what that's doing? Don't know. It's not having it though. No. This one will be for access, isn't it? Yeah, the workshop. The voice can change it. Well, it's all been emptied out, but um, don't know where the security are in here or not. Where? Oh yeah. Be good to get on the roof, really. Building engineering services. Oh, nearly, nearly, but not quite. Probably. Interface plant room. That's that was open. Look there, the thing. Look there, things above it is open. No, it's a bit stiff. I switch up. <laughs> yeah. No way. And this car's parked there, do you think that's a coincidence? Well, might be people in. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Shall we have a go? Ring for security, it says. Don't know. Want to have a look? It's been like abandoned, it? yeah. No, it's not abandoned. You By the BBC. No, it's not the BBC. It's not the BBC. It's not the BBC. It's a private property. Oh, it's been sold now, is it? No, no, no. I, I don't, I don't know. But it's, it's not the BBC. It's not the BBC. <laughs> it's okay. Not the BBC. Abandoned, yeah. No, it's not abandoned. You By the BBC. No, it's not the BBC. It's not the BBC. It's not the BBC, it's a private property. Oh, it's been sold now, is it? No. Abandoned, yeah? No, it's not abandoned. You're By the BBC? No, it's not the BBC. It's not the BBC. It's not the BBC, it's a private property. Oh, it's been sold now, is it? No, no, no. I Okay, we'll we'll, we'll, go, please, that's please, right. we'll yeah, go. we'll go. We're just, yeah. just going for a walk. We were just wondering if it, if it was abandoned, like, no, you know, no, we can come and have a look. No, yeah. Okay. <laughs>
Never mind. Oh, well. oh the housing estate over there. Right, yeah, jumped over the fence. Right. Big old building. So how long have the BBC not had it for I then? Know. I don't know. I, I can talk about it. I don't know. You don't know? No, I don't know. All right, fair enough. <laughs> okay. It's still, it's still anyway. listed on the BBC's website as, as ha actually I'm having this place. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's all right, we'll leave anyway. No yeah. Please, please. Yeah, no worries, man. <laughs> oh well. You never know until you try <laughs> getting into these places. <laughs> Take you anywhere. <laughs> this way, please, this way. Yeah, this way. No, he led us out the front way. We won't have to cut we won't have to climb over the fence then. Is this a bunk is this in a bunker? I don't know. An old nuclear bunker? I don't know. It's transmitter size, isn't it? Hmm. They seriously didn't want people coming in here, look, look those big barriers. You're never going to ram those. Look, it's got a big um, fuel tank in it, and that's a, that's a generator on the left-hand side. So it might be. Bunker! It's a nuclear bunker. Could be. Looks like a bunker to me. Do you get many people coming in, trying to get in there and have a look like we do? You are the first one, I think. No! My mate told me he got caught in there the other day. Yeah. Yeah, he said he was walking around inside. That's why we came. He said he was walking around inside. He's got photos and it looked really cool. And uh, his name is Callum. Yeah. And what's your name? Matthew. Matthew. I want to have one of my stickers on my channel on YouTube. You got that? That's me. Oh. You can have that. The secret. Secret vault. You can take secret. it. It's all right. That's, that's okay. I'll go. You don't want it? I got it. I got it, yeah. Go on. You can have it. Present. Nothing like a free sticker. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, wow. Well. At, at least we've had a little look of it. What are you going to do about it then? Well, obviously we can't come back, you know, because, like, you're allowed to come once, but when you're told you have to leave, you have to leave, that's it, so... But, uh... Well, it'd, be yeah. nice, it'd be nice to know who ran it, you need to ask permission whether or not you can come and see it, but whether they'll give permission or not is another thing, but... Yeah. It's definitely not the BBC, though, you're saying. We didn't have the BBC now. OK. We have just the security, so we do that now, so it's not the BBC. Right. Anyway. It used to be though, didn't it? Right. Used to be years ago. Who? Many years ago, it was a BBC site. I think so. But I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, it's got signs everywhere saying BBC. Is, is it still there? Well, yeah. You know, you know all these signs yeah. that in there. Yeah. That's the writing that the BBC use. All right. Okay. It's the font and everything. Okay. Yeah. I know about that, but by the way, this is the. You know, can I film this? Yeah. Right. Police dogs are there now, so, so you Police dogs on. training in this area, private property being used by Hampshire Constabulary. Do they train police dogs in you? Um, as I said, yes. Yeah, okay. Well, nice to meet you. Cheers. Operation. Ah. That was quite good fun, that was. You just saw it and we just went, please like, no, visit BBC, BBC Lanyard. I don't know. <laughs> when people start, when they start doing that, I just could stop. Did he have like, a BBC Lanyard on? Yeah. He had a BBC Lanyard yeah. on? Yeah, I didn't did spot that. He had a BBC Lanyard on. He had a BBC Lanyard yeah. on and he's telling us this is not the frigging BBC. That's why I Do you know what? Laughing. That is very sus, isn't it? That is really sus. 
1904, yeah. You thought BBC Lanyard, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, if you type in BBC Caversham Park, right, this is what comes up. And down the road, they've got the BBC Language something, Language Library or something. It's, it's the building just to the left of us now. So, no, it's, it's a bit further down here. It's the next building on the left that we'll see. That's why I couldn't stop laughing when it came out, so like... <laughs> <laughs> this guy was seriously trying to tell us this is not the BBC and he doesn't know if it's ever been the BBC and he doesn't know. It's like, mate, do you, do you know you're in England at the moment? Do you know, do you know, this, is a, this, is a man, do you know this is a mansion house? No, I don't know. It's like, do you get paid? I don't know. <laughs> do they come and feed you for once in a while? I don't know. No, I don't know. Don't know. <laughs> There's something in there up down to five. Yeah. <laughs> Something's going on in it. Yeah. It's very it's sus. If Jordan says there's something going on in there, there's definitely something going on in there. So here we Did go. Did you see his face when I started going, Yippee! That guy's face on that blood dear. I was like, it's, it's a, he's a bit autistic spectrum. <laughs> Ignore him. <laughs> <laughs> Classic. Oh. <laughs> but it's alright then, because he, he's like he would touch you then, see, because he's like afraid he'll get into trouble if he does yeah. anything, innit? Oh. That's good though, it's got like good cop, bad cop, isn't it? It's like yeah. Jordan's like, yippee! And I'm like, it's all right, you'll be fine, you just need to get him out. Look, private property, no public access, that is the BBC's font. That's, the, that's their font there. And just down here, it actually does still say BBC, because I think it's still in use. His lanyard said BBC. Yeah. That's yeah. not BBC. Yeah. <laughs> I'm blind. <laughs> <laughs> He's right. not going to walk around, security of the, of the company. Uh, going to walk. I think it is BBC, folks. <laughs> See, I told you. Look. See, they still use this bit. And that, to me, looks like the words BBC. There you go. And that bit over there is connected to this bit. So, don't know why they're trying to tell people it's not the BBC anymore. Unless they've got bunkers under there and you don't want people sniffing around. They definitely have but What building has a massive diesel tank outside of it like that? Yeah, that's a generator building, but do they actually have a bunker underneath that? Because they had lots of transmitters on the side of it as well. So it was also be it was the, the, the transmitters were right next to the generator. And what you normally have there is protected rooms to take a blast or stuff underground. So yeah, I think that is one place that probably would have bunkers. Well, there we go. So, thanks for watching. We're on to the next one. <laughs>